you to this atomic laser. <clears throat> I just uh a while ago I opened two boxes of um of uh cards. I got a box of uh, absolute and I got a box of select. Um and I'm buying cards off eBay is nice, but I mean it's, I like I like opening boxes and stuff. And I was sick of buying like low end packs at the hobby shop and not really getting anything, so I decided to just save up and um got a couple boxes. And uh, David Adams had a nice deal. It was like 200 bucks for both of them, so figured I might as well take a shot. Um, also, that they got, they had, I got a level two gift, so I didn't. They had like all the like Alabama and like Texas like uh, packs, but I decided to just go, go with an autograph photo. And this is the only guy I knew on there was uh, Ryan Fitzpatrick. So that's pretty cool. That's for trade for sale. So yeah, we'll start out with the box of absolute. I mean. It wasn't the best box, but I was like, it wasn't, it wasn't like, it wasn't too bad. I'm like, I'm happy with what I got. So, um, I only, I only got one rookie auto, which is good. So, here's the first card was a, uh, Dominique Wilkins, retired. That's the only number card. Oh, yeah, I didn't get any, like, uh, memorabilia cards. That was kind of disappointing. I was hoping for, like, a patch or something. But, uh, I'll show you what I got. First card was DeAndre Liggins. F out of, uh. 399. Next card auto was uh, Charles Oakley out of 99. Pretty cool. Played for the Knicks, so that's pretty cool. Uh, I don't like the sticker. I should have made an autograph, but I guess a big sticker is better than a small sticker. So, next one is nice for my U of M PC Glenn Rice auto out of 100. Pretty cool. And last autograph, I think it's pretty cool. Um, I really don't like the card. I don't really like the design of this card. I like the uh, how they did the. Design, but I mean, it's a good player. It's Andre Iguodala. That's on 99. I don't know why it's not magnetic, but whatever. Pretty cool card. All right, so next the box is select. Um, I did pretty. I did pretty. I think I did pretty pretty uh, solid on it. So the first card. This is what the base looks like. This is a Damian Lillard rookie card. Pretty cool. Then we got a uh, for the rookies. You got a Marcus Morris, white hot. That's just Azili hot rookies. John Henson, hot rookies. Oh, none of this stuff is for trade for sale. Or none of the uh, inserts and prisms are for trade for sale. I like them a lot. Uh, Blake Griffin, in flight. And uh, Dwight Howard, all star from the PC. And the last insert is a Patrick Ewing, Hall of Fame. This is a really cool looking card. I must say, um, Panini did a really good job on Select. Um, it's a really nice looking product. The price is a little bit. I got it around like a hundred bucks. That was a, that's a pretty. I think that's a pretty solid price for a select. It'd be around a hundred because a lot of the times the autographs are not like all really good. So I mean, you probably will get like one decent autograph most of the time, and it's not really worth like a hundred forty. But if if it's around a hundred, I think that's a good price for it. So if next year Panini, I think they should start the price lower. But the prisms and base look really nice. So here's the prisms I got. I got Kyle Lowry. Then I got two legends. I got Kevin McHale and Patrick Ewing. So that's it for the inserts. Now we'll go on to the hits. Um, the fr uh, my three rookie autographs were not that great. Well, they're okay. They're okay for bad rookies. They're okay. So I got Terrence Jones. That's out of one ninety nine. It's the prison version. Got Draymond Green from MSU. He plays pretty decently for the Warriors. Out of one ninety nine. And this guy's been beasting it up in uh, summer league, and then. And they just waived Drew Gooden, so he'll probably be getting some good minutes next year along Larry Sanders. He's pretty good defensively. It's uh, John Henson. That's out of 149. And then I did get one veteran autograph. Um, it's a jersey auto. I thought it was a patch because it's really thick, but it's a jersey auto. And that's a DeMar DeRozan. So I thought this was just like a regular decent autograph. I looked on the back, and it's a short, it's a short pin in out of 20. So I guess DeMar DeRozan's really short pin in this product. Again. All right, and the last card. Um, this is my my fourth prism. This is a really crazy, crazy, crazy card. Um, I'm super excited. This is the first pack, so I'll slow roll it. Um, I'll show. I'm gonna show the back first. I'll show you the numbering. So the numbering right there is 10 out of 25. So it is a prism. Then. Um, Oh, there it goes. 
Well, Kobe Bryant in flight prism. Really sweet card. Uh, this this is not for trade for sale right now. And uh, this is just an amazing looking card. It's it's pretty sweet. I have to take it out of my top loader or, some, or the magnetic sometimes just to look at it because it's really nice. Probably one of my favorite looking cards. So that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. And oh yeah, I have the box breaks on my phone recorded. But if you if you guys want to see them. Uh, just comment below. If I get like 10 comments, you guys, that you want me to upload them, I'll upload them. But my brothers are being kind of annoying in the background. So I, I, um, and they ended up being really long. Like one of them, the absolute's like five or six minutes, and the other one's, the absolute's five minutes, and select's like 11 minutes. So if you want to see them, just comment below, upload the videos. If I get like, if I get eight comments and you want to see them, I'll upload it. So let's see, you guys. Thanks for watching.